Hi, I'm Vishwam, working here as a business development manager. Hello, I'm Anil Kushwaha, head of technology at KSOLS. And I'm Swikriti, and this is Apache NiFi Support interview by KSOLS. So let's start with the most asked question about Apache NiFi. Uh, let's start with the very first question, sir. Anil, sir, I'll go with you first. Um, so can you explain the range of support that KSOLS offer for Apache NiFi? So if you are running Apache NiFi in a production, then we have, you know, different kinds of support that let you run the Apache NiFi with confidence in your production grade uh, system. First, we do uh, your cluster review and then we recommend uh, what are the gaps we find uh, for that. Mm. Second, we do uh, flow optimization. So suppose you have, you know, a number of flows there mm. and you feel that those are not, you know, uh, created in an optimal way. Yeah. We help you to optimize that. Third, we do uh, all your, you know, NiFi monitoring and all related stuff. So mm. anything you feel that there is a gap in NiFi monitoring and all, we support mm. on that. Fourth, we also do a NiFi upgrade. So support, suppose you are you want to upgrade your NiFi, you are mm. planning to upgrade, we will help you in that as well. Mm. We also support uh, security aspect of the NiFi. Okay. And we also support to integrate NiFi with, you know, uh, different third party systems like mm. for authentication and authorizations. We support LDAP integrations. We also support the RBAC for the NIFI. Okay, I think that that was a great uh, sum up of my question. Uh, I think I will ask you another question, yep. and uh, that would be: What are the support availability hours, and uh, do you also offer any emergency support? Absolutely. So okay. typically, we provide twenty-four-seven support, right? Hmm. But we also tailor it as per client's requirements, That's right? Okay. So you might want sixteen cross seven support. You might want eight cross five support. So we tailor it as per your requirements. That's mm -hmm. one. Mm -hmm. And to answer your second question, if we provide production related support, emergency support, emergency support yeah. so anything happens to your NiFi pipeline, mm -hmm. anything happens to the production server, our technical expert will come and play, help you out, review it, mm -hmm. and as per the SLAs defined, we'll solve that problem. And for how you. quick is that? If there's an emergency, yeah. um, how quick do you respond? So typically, it is defined based on the SLAs, the service level agreements that we have, mm. right? But typically, I'd say L1 support is 30 minutes. That's how we okay. uh, answer. So basically, you know, we have the different kind of a severity defined. So what kind of a severity issue that you have reported, yeah. huh. then we have, you know, uh, those kind of uh, response time and the resolution time is there. So, you know, your production system is down and you are raising a ticket. Hmm. The response time will be 30 minutes and the resolution time will be two hours. Okay. So we will uh, brought up your production back within the two hours. I think that's quite quick to, yeah. I think, resolve yeah. any issue, I guess. And I think the more severity, you yeah. quickly respond yeah. so, to that. I mean, the production is the, you know, the highest severity and then hmm. you have a lower level environment or maybe you know, where your production is not down. Mm -hmm. So you have the system running maybe partially, but you are not wholly logged, you know, your whole production is not down. Then we have a lower severity, maybe, you know, for our one hour response time and then for our the resolution time. Okay. So where, you know, something where you are, you know, uh, getting loss of your business, we have a very quick response yeah. time, yeah. 30 minutes. I think that's, that's a support. Yeah. Anything where you lose yeah. money, okay. we yeah. are instantly yeah. replying there. Yeah. there. Yeah. <laughs> I think that's great and uh, my next most asked question would be also that how do, how do you differentiate from the other competitors in the market? How does KSOL stands out? So uh, let me take that Anil. Uh, typically of course the first point to be answered right, instant replies, mm -hmm. anywhere you lose money we come into play. We come with more than 10 years of experience, a decade of experience specifically in big data. We were one of the first players in India. Mm -hmm. uh, if I talk about uh, companies of our size, uh, public listed, team size of 600 engineers, we would be, probably we would be the only company contributing to the open source code base of NiFi. So that's another advantage, right? Uh, we are dealing with clients around the world, mm -hmm. uh, US, Australia, Europe, you name it, any region. Right. We have dealt with almost all industries. We are an industry agnostic company. So you come from uh, so the finance sector, you come from telecom, you come from retail, you come from real estate will solve your problems. So basically, you know, uh, we are supporting the customer, those have, you know, the petabytes of the data moving daily, you know, through the NiFi and they are hmm. getting that data, doing some transformation and then sending it to the downstream system. Hmm. So we are scaling, supporting, we have, you know, experience to the supporting those get up the customers. Okay, so, can, you, can you explain so because I didn't get the last. So basically, you know, we are supporting the customer, basically few of the telecom customers, right. they have the petabytes of the data uh, transfer daily so they are 
uh, handling the data through the NIFI and if they are running into the any mm. issues, mm. Uh, you know, we are supporting on them. So you can see that, you know, how big data size we are mm -hmm. supporting daily, they are transferring. So I think that's one of the other differentiators that you're telling me. So, yeah. Okay. Any, anything else that you want to add? Uh, maybe I can talk a little bit about the different types of industries we have dealt with mm -hmm. to give you a yeah, high level idea. Yeah, I think idea. that was my another question and I think I'm sure you can take it up. Perfect. So starting off with the telecom industry, right? Mm -hmm. Uh, in the telecom space, we are working with a Fortune 500 company dealing with their Apache and IFI pipelines. Okay. We are working with a big bank in the Middle East. Oh. And uh, outside of that, there are industry use cases in shipping and logistics based out of US and Australia both. Hmm. We are working with, we also uh, managed a project, dealt with the project with a user base of 100 million. It was hmm. for the government of India. Wow and multiple such use cases, right? These are just some things that are coming to the top of my mind. But mm. yeah, just to give you a highlight. So I think KSOLS has always been there. Like it's been yeah. quite long since uh, KSOLS. Yeah, it's is pretty good picture. that we are, you know, supporting. 10 years of 10 years. Years. <laughs> 10 years and as you know, we were talking about, we were one of the first players in India yeah. in the big data space back in 2014. Great, great. So my another question would be also uh, with, I think Vishwam will yeah. be answering it because you, I think, deal with the client side. Yeah. So how do you meet the client's expectation accordingly? You know, different clients, you have to meet to their requirements. So how do you cater to that? So I'll extend to what I said earlier, right? The mm. first priority, as Anil also said, right? Mm. We understand what exactly is the infrastructure of our client. Mm. What kind of pipelines do they already have? Right. Right. And then we start proposing. So the first phase is always discovery, mm. understanding what the client wants. Okay. Post that, we start proposing solutions, creating a roadmap to mm. solve for those issues. Mm. And then comes, of course, the support that we provide. Right. So uh, based on different severity, we define SLAs. We provide 24 seven support. Mm. We can tailor the support as per your requirements. You might not want full 24 yeah. cross 7 support, mm -hmm. right? You might want 8 cross 5, uh, four, uh, 5 working days. You might want 16 cross 7. Based on your specific needs, mm -hmm. we will tailor those support packages. Mm -hmm. All these support packages have a set number of tickets in place, mm -hmm. right? And they're priced differently. These are things that, of course, you know, case to case mm -hmm. basis we discuss, but all these support packages have tickets in place, mm -hmm. right? And as Anil rightfully said, anything where you lose money, Anywhere, any place where the production issue is down, where you can potentially mm -hmm. lose money, it's priority number one for yeah. us. We're not going to let you lose any money. <laughs> yeah. I mean, if you that's lose money, priority. we lose money. Yeah, that's uh, the priority. Yeah. And adding to the Bistom, you know, so yeah. basically we have, you know, ad hoc kind of support as well. Suppose where you're not looking, you know, a yearly kind of a package, you know, yeah. fixed number of package, you don't want to pay for that. Hmm. But you have few things in your mind, like, you know, I have some performance issues or maybe hmm. I'm looking to upgrade my NIFI, hmm. right? So we also, you know, support those, those ad hoc kind of, you know, support basically okay. where you have fixed uh, things, certain things to do. Hmm. We will estimate that we will give you a fixed cost and then we come work with your team and, you know, we will deliver that. So we are also, you know, hmm. that is something we are doing to meet our customer expectations. expectations. I think that's great. I think that's what the client needs. Yeah. <laughs> okay, great. I think uh, there are two other questions that I would want to ask. So what steps do you take to analyze and understand a client's current NIFI setup? Okay, so, you know, we have a different approaches to this. Hmm. What we have uh, learned through, you know, our experience earlier, we used to, you know, do that manually going to reviewing the, uh, you know, client cluster informations hmm. in the, you know, working sessions and all. Over the time, we got the experience and we have, you know, developed certain discovery scripts. So basically, you know, hmm. where we will provide those scripts to the customer, they will run it through the on their cluster and those what those scripts, scripts basically do they will crawl their all the NIFI configurations files mm. their logs files and mm. then they will collect and they will generate those in you know the logs files and they are going to send to us and then we will review that file mm. and after that we will feel that you know few more information will be needed then we will do a working session with the customer we will review all those things uh, in the working sessions in the call mm. and whatever other information they have basically so you know. is this is the effective system to go about yeah so basically you know first we have you know those discovery scripts that need to be run by the customer they will right. generate a lot of information mm -hmm. mostly most of the time that will sufficient but still okay. if we we'll need it we will do a working session and go through all the setup the customer has. okay i think that simplifies uh, yeah. the structure 
Um, also, do you provide support for both cloud-based and on-premises uh, NiPy developments? Yes, we do. Yes, but we also support, you know, few of the customers, they are running some other, you know, enterprise grade of the Apache NiPy mm. uh, and they looking uh, support on top of that. Mm. Maybe, you know, they are not getting timely resolve their issues or maybe, you know, due to the, some other issues, but they also look, you know, uh, case all support on top of those enterprise data Apache and Wi-Fi and we mm. are supporting them well there. Okay, okay. So I think there's an overall support that case alls provide for Apache and Wi-Fi. And I think that was great talking to you guys. And I think we gained a lot of valuable information. I hope it helps the clients yeah. who will be watching this. And thank you so much. Thank, thank you, Zukriti. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.